back with today's video the urge to sleep and not work out was was strong today i was literally in the drawing room uh, sleeping on the sofa and uh, i was taking a nap but that nap felt so comfortable i was telling myself just get up from this nap and go to bed straight it's only 8 15 but yesterday i went to sleep at 3 a.m don't ask why and i woke up at 8 so basically five hours of sleep had to uh, had to stay awake the entire day had work to do and just towards the end now I'm so tired but um, let's start warming up today's legs not gonna go as heavy well just gonna clear all of this stuff bring the squat racks here and start squatting I think I'll just keep it to to squatting today just gonna do six sets of pure squat and maybe I'll include some Bulgarians and maybe I'll include some hamstring RDLs but I will be doing six sets of squats no doubt about that top set might be 75 or 81 <sighs> this place is so dirty I need to clean up a bit I get the argument for not wearing gloves while you do lifting especially on the bench press or on the pull-up bar but and it's frowned upon which I understand I mean you're supposed to have calluses on your on your hand but oh I, I don't know why the the pad for squatting is frowned upon they call it the CC pad or whatever they call it I actually have it and I mean on lighter weights it's fine but when you're doing a whole lot of weight you might want to be using one of these but I know power lifters don't use it so why should you but are you a power lifter? Do you lift as heavy as they do? Do you have the commitment, the consistency as they do? I don't think so. So why are you talking trash about people who use this? I don't use gloves, but I don't want a callus on my back. I mean, actually I do, but like if it hurts and it's under values and under makes you underperform while you lift do you really need it yeah you do I mean just because it hurts doesn't mean it's like actually detrimental to your health but
think that is it for today. Six sets of squats. I think that's good enough of a stimulus for legs. Uh, today protein intake has been good. I've been eating well. I'm going to weight myself, see how much I am. I've been feeling fat. Definitely I've been feeling fat. I've been seeing more fat than muscle. <laughs> It might mean that I'm bulking right, but um, yeah, once I hit that 80 kilos, well, that was the goal initially. Now, considering a lot of factors, well, if you, if you can even call it that, uh, I might see myself bulking till, till the end of this year, which is just two more weeks and then I'm gonna start a proper diet cut I think that's the first time I've mentioned a cut but definitely gonna tone down from 1st of January on the calories and gonna try to keep uh, protein and other macros proper uh I don't know, these last couple of days I haven't been able to really focus on the content just because I'm busy, but staying consistent, filming my workout sessions, my cardio sessions, and trying to talk a bit, and trying to upload, but till now I haven't missed, so that's good. That's what being consistent is, uh, and disciplined, of course. Even when you don't want to do it, you do it. And then you see what happens. But yeah, I mean, uh, pretty tired. Gonna go take a shower, eat chicken breast, and maybe one of those tortillas. I don't have cheese, so I'll have to make do with other other things. But yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today. Stay sharp, stay active. Peace.